Loving that outfit, Nox. Why don't you wear one? Oh, that's the only one. And if anyone stands a fighting chance in there, it's you. Forget about fashion and go. <clears throat> Testing. Do you read me? Just wanted to thank you for offering to clear out those demons. That'll give me time to treat this mithril for you. There's a hunter who went in right ahead of you. I imagine there are too many for one to handle. But two of you should be fine. And a little heads up. We're getting some unstable readings from the generators inside. Too much power and the whole place could blow. So be quick. Will do. So, you might back up. I thought we were partners. Anyway, place is crawling with demons. I just... you sound familiar. Save the talk. We got hunting to do. Now, if we're done with the introductions, follow me. In there. As promised, here's your mithril. And, uh, thank you for your hard work. Sure. Hey, big guy! So the hunter who went on ahead... The one and only. <laughs> How you been, fellas? Oh, not bad. Oh, someone did a number on you, though. You should see the other guy. Anyway, I'm back. And better than ever. Knocked? Gladdy? I can't believe it! Hey, thanks for looking after her, Dustin. So, Gladdy, did you apologize to Noct for storming off like that? He made it up to me in there. The power plant? Oh, so you got your hands on some mithril. In that case, I'll go deliver it to Sid. You'll probably want to freshen up first anyway. Come and meet me and Kayam when you're ready. Really looking forward to Iris' cooking. I'll pretend I didn't hear that. Aw, oh, don't be that way. It's different when a girl cooks for you. Goodbye for now. I 
Regalia is already waiting below deck. Hopefully, she'll serve you as well across the ocean as she did here. Just don't break her, or Sid'll have your head. Something I gotta get off my chest. <sighs> What's that? I'm sorry. Sorry I wasn't there for your father. I swore an oath to protect the king, but I wasn't strong enough to uphold it. <sighs> Ain't nothing nobody could have done to stop what happened. Yeah. I realize that. But you need to realize just what you mean to the boys by your side. <sighs> I do. Even if they can't solve your problems, you can't hide what's going on from them. It hurts like hell. Remember, those ain't your bodyguards. They're your brothers. Trust in them, always. Waiting for an invitation? Get your asses on board! <laughs> 